Oh, it's a good With day in Red Dead Redemption 2, ladies and gentlemen. For your good old Elias Green. Finally getting what he deserves. Elias Green. It's going down, the baby. Of the Skinner Brothers gang. Mutilated and murdered countless innocent travelers. Here to watch Bounty Hawk, sucker. Look at this. Do something. A Skinner He left appalling scenes of brutality in his wake. Well, Mr. Green. Your foul reign is at an end. You will reap what you have sown. Dirty son of a bitch! For your evils, you will hang. Okay. All right, let's end this bastard. Do it. Got him. Oh, crap. That's it. Driving things up. A there bit. will be no tolerance for their behavior in this community. That's it. Well, Let hello. This be a lesson to all the other skinners. You glorious people we of the interweb. For we are righteous. And welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. A great day. I don't remember what I was doing. I got very distracted. I figured, you know, the, uh, the O brother, the basically the, the side quest with the two brothers that want to get their groove on with that one lady who seems to be dealing with it for some strange reason. But regardless, we've never done that as John before. And we've done it as Arthur. And it's a fun little side quest. We should have it available for John to do, and I feel like it'd be fun today. Just to see if there's anything different about it. I hope you guys all enjoy the video. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Ah, uh, good old Valentine. One of the best... One of my favorite towns, at least. In Red Dead Redemption 2. I don't know why. My friend. You there. Well, here we go. What's going on, brothers? Hello. Don't wave at me like that. Not today, yeah, homie. Want? Not today. Do I look like a coward to you? I mean, obviously I do, because I look like that milksop there, but tis no matter. Can you help? Maybe. See? Even he is sick of hearing your nonsense, you afterthought of a child. I apologize, sir, for his smell. Why don't we come back here? To somewhere more conducive to displays of utter gallantry and deep seated inadequacy what do you have in mind shoot a bottle off my head like william tell this is getting silly very silly the man is a moron <laughs> shoot one off mine instead yeah, i'm the brave one i'm not scared i'm a pretty good shot boys but i won't even flinch i don't want to hurt you Oh, I can't lose. Either I'll prove my masculinity or die and be spared his company. Come, sir, please. Okay, then. <sighs> I like that you actually you sure everybody can't knows? kill them even though they or said they would die. Either. Of course, of course, of course. You boys are ridiculous. One of the most ridiculous side missions. Oh, you know what? You'll go first. Don't think too much what happens if we aim it? <laughs> She's like, no! No, please, sir! You'd think she'd run away after that. <laughs> you got mine, and I barely... Good shot! <laughs> <laughs> that was fun! <laughs> what was? I feel like we didn't even do anything. Oh, of course you didn't. We all know you're hardly sentient at all. Another round. I bet he pooped his pants bottles, just a little bit. Sir, please. What? I don't know. Please, this creature is unbearable. He needs silencing. I'll do my best. As long as she witnesses, I'm doing this under duress. Oh, you boys are so silly. All that cleavage making him crazy. Them tig old biddies. Shoot, sir, while our courage holds. Uh... Nothing to fear but fear itself. <laughs> now I'll stand on one leg. Me too. You keep shooting, sir. And this time you kill the beast. He emerged fully formed from the swamps. Helen. Silence, you blackguard. Sir, shoot the wretch. <laughs> You're deranged. Shoot away, sir. My bottle and his brains, if you please. At least I have brains. Well, oh, God. I must be the bravest man I That got a little sketchy, didn't it? My turn. Oh, I missed! Oh, you better watch out! Excellent. 
Now do one while I hop. Do one while I turn somersaults. Uh, shoot me. Oh, give me the gun. Let me shoot him. Uh, for all mankind. I think me and the lady have had enough. Oh, I don't blame you, sir. This man's tongue, I would run too if I could. Here, for your skills and talents. Thank you. Now, brother, I am going to walk Helen home. Don't follow us. She has an elderly aunt, and I fear the sight of you could finally finish her off. Helen, is this creep bothering uh, you? You two, come along. Oh, no, there aren't two. There's me and the lizard man. Please, my angel, do not The lizard the man. Boys, you are too <laughs> oh, it's ridiculous. So, let's see here. Um, did they actually go back to the hotel? I've had a bunch of people ask me... To, to go back and see if we can find them. I don't know if it's exactly this particular mission, but uh, we're going to find out. Welcome. Why is there so many ladies in here? What are you doing? Why are you smoking inside? It's going to burn the house down. Hello, ladies. Hello, good looking. Sucky, sucky, five dollar. You all having fun? Mm -hmm. Is this where the prostitutes hang out? Ain't they something? Hmm. Interesting town. I know, right? I've, I guess we can't do it. They're just, they're just chilling in here, I guess. We finally got our approved look and gave John a little bit of a trim so he doesn't look like hammered ass. And we should. There it is. Oh, brother, number two. Where are you beautiful human beings? Now, you see, Helen, Acre here is a silly boy. And Protus isn't a boy at all, but a chimpanzee that a man shaves up. You can't punch, my sweet. It's sad, really. Oh, my, our friend. Hello? I bet you can punch. Do me and the lady a favor here, would you? And thrash this impudent wretch. Thrash? No man alive can thrash me. What was your name, sir? John. John could. Easily. You, maybe, but not me. I know. Punch us both. As hard as you can. You'll break his glass jaw, and I'll be left standing. <laughs> the knight and the knave. Good idea. Hit me, then. Dear boy, give the feeble fellow a little tap <laughs> She's and She's just like, I crumble. give up. Where'd she go? Uh... Is she just gonna watch? Oh, yeah. Come on. Let's hang out with her. What you got going on, girl? You wanna get punched? Do you think you hey. can hold up to a punch? Just doesn't even notice him here. Right there. <laughs> All right, let's do this. No mercy. Oh, I gotta punch him first. Ah! Oh, that was like a slap, John. What are you doing, man? You really walloped him. Right, yikes! I'm fine. Come so confused on. here. Let's do this. Ah, okay, that was a little bit better of a punch. I got a proper chin. Not like that toe rag. God, Lord above. Doesn't hurt. Their mouths aren't moving. That's so weird. There we go. Weren't you taught never to hit girls? Punch a man for once. Give me your worst. I think he's done for. Barely even felt it. There's only one thing for it then. Hit me in the manhood. Oh god, not the manhood. Oh, sorry, sir. No. Steel. Oh Real god. Steel. I forgot about this no part. Back this time. Oh my god. Oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> They've come out his ears. <laughs> my turn. <laughs> oh. Oh, I forgot Come about on, this part. <laughs> oh my god. Enough, gentlemen? Yes, oh. I think so. Oh, I slipped. And I hope you killed the leprechaun. And he's still alive? Shoot him, please. One of you. There, there. Up you get. We need to get some steak on those wounds. Madam, gentlemen, good luck to you. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever got into your heads? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. So we can actually follow them back to the hotel. I'm curious on, to know what they say. I'm fine. Really. It's that wretch who needs the rest. I've never been back. You could ask for a massage. Giggity. I could ride to a strawberry in the state I'm in. Both of you are going to bed. And that's How the end do? of it. A bath. 
Maybe that's what I need. Would you bathe me, sweet Helen? Do you hear that wretch? <laughs> that lascivious monster? If you're bathing anyone, you're bathing you me. I'll oh, just bathe them you together. Can be assured of my chivalry, fair girl. Here's a hotel. We're almost there. She just ignores him. Have your fun with these boys. Now let me look after them. I just want to see what happens. I bet they walk up here and just don't do anything anymore. Okay. Now lie oh. down and rest. Now don't get left behind, buddy. Oh. I think the game is over, mister. It's not. I want to watch. Rest. I like to rest. watch. Oh. Ah. Uh, I like to be weird. Mate, I'm pretty sure we can break inside. Ah. Oh. We need to walk outside so we can pull our gun first. Damn, this lady just Please said I ain't been screwed in a while. And she's probably right, knowing Abigail. Poor, poor John. Uh, I've given up trying to break into there. They're not making any noise, so I'm pretty sure they're just standing there doing nothing. I got someone to help you. Because that's typically what happens. Well, there they are. Finally ready to do the final mission. And this is where I would like to try and kidnap her at the end, if possible. <laughs> um, I think it would be fun. I don't know. I kind of want to just, you like, shoot one in the leg and see and what happens. Nuisance, brother. Helen, is this creepy little toad bothering you again? Shall I throw him off? This is getting quite out of hand. Hands? Oh, he doesn't have hands. He's a troll. <laughs> That's why we found him here. Got hooves? He escaped. From his Would you tell your talking monkey to go home, please, Helen? He was amusing at first, but now he's really quite tiring. Plus, I do wish they had shaved his palms as well as his face. If we kidnap, if we kidnap Helen. What will they do? I'm really curious. All right, I wonder if it'll let us. We've got Helen here. If we. What happens if we... I don't think it's going to let us do it. Maybe if we walk up close to her? Hmm. All right, let's give this a shot. Yeah, no, it's not going to... It's not going to do it. We could shoot at her. But if we do that, everything will get butt hurt. I wonder... We could blow them up off the cliff. It kind of saves them the trouble, I guess. And then that'll allow us to get Helen. Um, it's Cornelius! What are you doing, buddy? Get out of the way! There we go. Ah, uh, oh. Get back here! Oh my god, Helen's so quick! Holy Jesus! I'm sorry, Cornelius. You were in the right spot. Jesus, she's like Usain Bolt. Holy crap. The fastest human ever. Where's she gonna run to? Wonder if there's some kind of... Oh, she's got invisible Helen legs. Oh, she's running so fast her legs are invisible. Oh my God. This is ridiculous. She could win the Olympics. I'm not exactly sure where she's going, but this is getting a little creepy now. John just hunting down a poor lady through the woods. Um, I think more likely than not that she's just running away. She's got no backup option to go anywhere because I could actually go to another side of her and she'll run in a different direct. Oh my God. She'll run in a different direction. Now NPCs that are running to a location, they won't do that. They will just keep running to wherever they're trying to go. Uh, so I could theoretically chase her somewhere and be like, ha, pretend like she actually ran here. But that's not going to actually be the case in this particular situation. It's a bear! Oh, man! What is a bear? Oh, shit! Oh, no! Oh, we can stop! Horse, what are you doing? No! no! Stop! Oh, oh, my God! That bear just took... It just killed an elk! What is this bear doing? Whoa! Charge him, horse! This is the bravest horse in the history of horses! Yeah, come at me, bro! 
You want some? You stupid bear? A hog tire. I will hog. This is the bravest horse in the history of horses. It's a miracle. Come at me, bro. Let's play some chicken. Oh, shit. Oh. The end is nigh, ladies and gentlemen. The end is nigh. Christ. Bad bear. Bad bear. Drop the dynamite, Arthur. Jump. Whoever you are, why the hell? Freaking bears. Bears suck so bad. I'm not going to live through this one. Or am I? Ha ha. You bear bastard. Well, I've never seen a bear take out an elk before. Or was that just a regular deer? That thing got riggedy, riggedy. Oh, it was a wolf. And a deer. This bear was just going to town. Ridiculous. Now that we've had our fun, I suppose we can finish the side quest up. You are a fool and a nuisance, brother. Helen, is this creepy little toad bothering you? Oh, John, how are you? Never better. I see you two haven't changed much. No, he's still a lizard. Coward, gerbil, mommy's boy. Manatee. Effluent discharge. Milk sap. You are oh, you milk sap. Uh, I did not. <laughs> You're a milk sap. Well, you are all chatter and no testes, dear brother. Helen, I will make you love me if it's the last thing I do. And to prove how suitable I am to make a happy and stable life with, I shall throw myself over the waterfall in just a barrel. And so shall I, just to demonstrate how little your feeble gestures mean, you homunculus. John, please come do the honors and make sure we, um, <laughs> oh, you silly little tapeworm of a man. Follow me. Follow you? I was born first. Helen, I love you. Brother, you're living proof of God's remarkable sense of humor. Oh, boy. Here we go. Farewell, sweet princes. Now, Helen, let's get out of here. I've got a horrible, horrible wife. This, after all the other things that they've done. <laughs> this is... Why would you even let them do this the whole time? Get on your horse. Follow me. That's the real question. Whoa. Whoa. Did she say anything? If further down, we won't reach them from here. We won't reach... They're all right? They might be. You want them to be all right? I was just thinking, might be easier for you if, if only one of them was... Uh, you catch my meaning? Sir, that is a terrible thing to say. You got a favorite? I like them both equally. What a horrible yeah, woman. Maybe fate might help you out. It is not like that, mister. Not like that at all. Ah! There you are. A Christmas. What have you done? <laughs> Brother, are you there? Acri! Huh? Is that you? <laughs> I've had the wind knocked out of me. <laughs> I thought you were a goner. <laughs> it's a miracle we're alive. <laughs> silly, silly voice. You nearly died for me. <laughs> She's right. Dear brother, what fools we've been. <laughs> You're the fool, <laughs> but a brave one. You might be dense, but you are the noblest man I know. <laughs> the story you of two brothers lion, falling giant. in love. You're an earth shaker. World conqueror. Ow. Let's not let anything come between us again. Never. Boys? I, I, <laughs> Good lady, adieu. Bewitch some other milk sops. <laughs> we will have none of it. But I, I thought Web, that... Before this siren calls us to the rocks again... Let us away from here. You lead the way, brother. The West awaits. Boys! <laughs> Boys! <sighs> <laughs> some suitors you picked there. I was trying to stop them from killing themselves. They won't last a week without me. No, probably not. But you'll have an easier time. I guess I will. 
Were you really oh, trying to stop man. them from killing themselves, though? Because she certainly let them do a lot of stupid oh, things. I wasn't trying to lead them on, you know? Uh-huh. It was just exciting. <laughs> the smartest man I knew with positively the least sense. <laughs> well, that's usually how it works. Good luck. Farewell, sweet princess. Oh, is it going to make her despawn on me? Oh, it did. How dare it. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to hit that like button as it really helps out. And we'll see you all in the next one.